We've been making lots of movie magic with AI tools on this channel lately. And recently I was given access to Runway AI's the green screen feature where you can mask an object with movement from one clip and remove that object to import it into a new clip. So I thought today we would make a little magic with that. If you want to keep making magic with this channel, be sure you give us a like and subscribe and go ahead and hit that notification bell so you know every time one of our new videos drops. Now let's get into it. So the first thing we're going to do is go into Canva and we're going to hit create a design up here and choose video and then we're going to come over to elements and we're going to put in running and I'm going to specifically look for videos on this one of runners and I'm really looking at for someone like running away from something. So this one might be good. So I'm just gonna size it to fit the screen here. And then I don't really need 35 seconds. I only need about five seconds of this. So I'm just gonna pick which part I think would be good for what I'm gonna edit. And I think back here where she's against the sand would probably be the best for the color contrast. So let's go five seconds here. And I'm just gonna split this page Get rid of this one and I'm gonna name my design up here and then I'm gonna hit share. So I'm gonna come into download and I'm going to leave it on the suggested MP4 video here and I'm just gonna go ahead and hit download. You can see it doesn't take too long. And while that's doing that, we'll hop over into Runway. And this is their green screen feature with their AI magic tools. And it actually is in beta. It's pretty new. So we actually just got to jump in and play with it. And we thought we would show you guys how you could make a pretty funny video in just a couple minutes. So let's see if that's done downloading. Not quite, but close. Here we go. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull this on over. Okay, so you can see that we've pulled that onto the timeline for the video editor in here in the green screen. And over on the right, you'll see where the new AI magic tools are. And you can come down to the green screen and you'll see it says click an area to start masking. So we're gonna go ahead and come over and we wanna mask this lady that's running on the beach. So I'm gonna click here, here. Typically about three spots is good. You wanna make sure you're filling in any place that it's going to catch her motion. And you can go ahead and hit preview here and you'll see if there's any missing spots that you need to add or anywhere that you need to detract from as she's running. So this actually has really good separation. I think that's gonna be just fine. So the second part then is going to be to actually remove the background and that's going to be done when we come up here on the top right and hit done masking. And then you can see it came out pretty good, pretty clear that she's running. We can apply the feather around her over here, which will change kind of the sharpness of the outer part of her image. But I think this is good for what we need. So the second part is to take this little red line back to the beginning here and I'm going to come over into my download folder and grab an image that I created using Dolly of a dragon breathing some fire. And then I'm going to bring it over here into Runway and just pull it on over into the asset upload. And you can see up here it is uploading right now. And there we go. So we have that image. So I'm going to go ahead and add that in now to the timeline. Come over here and you can see this purple button where it just says add to timeline. Okay, so now we can layer them on top of each other. Okay, so once you've pulled in the dragon image and you have the girl that's running pulled into your timeline here, you can simply right click on your mouse, right click on your mouse and hit send to back and you'll see that it sends the dragon image to the back and puts her in the forefront of the picture here. So you can tilt her, you can change where she's at on here, but I'm gonna shrink her down just a little bit. Make sure my dragon image is completely pulled out in the frame here. And then let's see what we've got. Okay, so there you have it, that one's pretty cool, but we can make it cooler by using Runway's animation tool to have the dragons fire move along with the image. So in order to do that, we're going to go ahead and name this design up at the top. We'll name this girl running on beach away from dragon, simple enough. 
We'll go back to home and we're gonna do start with an image and we're going to go ahead and upload that image of the dragon here. And you see now that it's uploaded, I'm gonna come over to image and description and I'm going to put, make the fire appear to be coming from the dragon's mouth. And then I'm going to hit generate. You can see that's all we're gonna do for now on the runway videos because we are officially one second away from our total for how many we're allowed to use for the month. Okay, so now we've got that created. Let's see what that looks like here. Put a little bit of movement onto the fire. Not bad, I think we'll go ahead and download that. And then we're gonna go back into the green screen portion that we were just in here. And we're going to pull in that video that we just made the same way into upload asset. And we can go ahead and get rid of this image of the dragon. So all we're gonna do is right click there and hit delete. And now we've got our four second clip here of the dragon. So we can go ahead and select that and we'll hit the add to timeline. We'll stretch it out here and then we'll do our right click and we'll hit send to the back again and then we've got our runner so we can move her anywhere we want on the frame we'll go like right here and then since that video is only going to be four seconds i'm going to come up to the runner on the editing timeline and i'm just going to slide this down so that it lines up so that she stops running when the dragon um, video is finished so let's go ahead and preview that by coming back over and hitting play composition and there you have it we just made a woman running from the fire breathing dragon from an image that we found in canva to the green screen effect in runway and putting them together to make that quick video Okay, so once you have the video created and you're happy with how it looks, you can come up to the top here and just hit this purple export button and you can choose your resolution and your format. If you have upgraded, you can do this pro resolution or the PNG, but I'm fine just taking it in an MP4 for now. So I'm gonna go, I'm going to go ahead and hit export video. And then you can see it says export submitted, view it in the assets page. So what I'm gonna do is come back here to home and I'm going to come down to the assets folder. And then you'll see right now that it is exporting that video there. This is the other one we made just playing with it. And we wanna know which one you think is better. This one or the one we just made together. And the one we just made is all finished on its exporting here. So there you go. Let us know in the comments which one you liked better. If you need to download it to export it from that system, all you have to do is come into the video from your assets page and come down to these three dots down here and you'll see it has download. Click that and it will download straight away. Thanks for joining me to learn a little bit about Runway's new AI magic tool green screen feature. Be sure you stay tuned. Next week, we're going to bring you guys a really exciting video where I show you exactly how I create images using Playground AI, Leonardo AI, and Dolly 3 to produce high quality images that can be used for content or sold on various platforms. I'm Jessica with The Real AI Agents. And remember, keep looking towards the future.